So we are just on the outskirts of Maltby, which is in South Yorkshire. We've come down to Eve's Mams, and um, but we've all come and we've brought a little picnic with us, and we're down in the valley of Roach Abbey. So there's a, a, a monastic ruins here, but what we've done is we've just come down this little um, track here and parked here next to a river in the Roach Abbey Valley. There's nobody here, and it's just a quiet for a little picnic spot, and it's free to park because I was told that you have to pay park at the abbey and things and for some reason sat has brought us here anyway so it's got a um it tells you it's a it's a, a triple si site a special site of interest roach abbey valley the limestone soils and um a lot of wildlife and things like that so we're just here the stream is just down on the bottom here we'll have a look see what this says here roach abbey road yeah, it's just it's just a sort of cobbly road. There's a car coming down now. We just come down that. Um, all vehicles must leave before gates to main road lock at 5:30 p.m. All right, looks like there's some ruins and things there. So we'll have a walk along there in a bit. Um, but it looks like it's it's quite all right. So we just walked from the little car park there. We're just starting to walk along here, would you? You see the old stone here? I'm going to head through Look along here. So this is um, it's known as Roach Valley, but it's also the river is called Maltby Dyke. Uh, the stream that runs through here. And there's limestone cliffs in this area as well. So we're going to head up. So here we go. This looks like a an early section here. We'll walk underneath here, look. A sort of gate house or something. Vaults. Look at that, look at that stonework and everything there. So the abbey was, um, oh yeah, so this is the English heritage uh, area here. I think you can just walk on the outside of it. <clears throat> so the abbey was, um, 1100s and it housed some of the just be this sort of little gatehouse area housed 50 monks the 100 lay brothers would be here so i think you'd pay to get in it cost like 50 quid i mean five six five six quid guided tours look we're doing but we're just going to walk on the outside path so that's the paid english heritage go in there but actually you walk on this path you get to see it anyway so the landscape itself around the abbey in the um, 18th century was then ordered by capability brown so you've got the original abbey from 1100s and then capability brown came along and sort of maneuvered things and put follies and things no no this bit's the public footpath that's bit in behind there is where you pay to get in and what's the point of that yeah that's a good good question so we're just going to walk along this bit you see the free bit and you get to see it pretty much just as well only thing you can't do is stand on it <coughs> so here we are this is roach abbey go on and you take photographs yeah. so this is it look roach abbey and if you're on that side of the fence you have to pay to get in and this side it's free what's the point in that the way they ordered, so you get the stream, I don't know if you can hear it, it runs along there. And, and what happens was the monks' toilets used to be just directly above the stream. And so they'd just go straight to the stream and that would wash it all away, the toilets. And in fact, they designed it to like dab up a little bit, so that would be even faster flowing going past I the abbey to get it away this. This is the quickly. Health. Yeah, this is so given the date of it, I given, I the, given the date, which was 1100s, is quite a, quite an impressive I thing that they, they sped up the water say. to get rid of it. So they built it next to a stream, is it? <laughs> right. And then they so had lead pipes that led, led to a conduit in the middle. Oh, no, no, let's have a look. So, the crags around Roach Abbey of national importance because the plants are growing because they're, that's why it's a triple SI. So they're protected. It's an important geological site. In spring, yellow carpets of wild daffodil with white flowers or of wild garlic or ransoms. Um, but some of the elms have died from Dutch elm disease. 
The gorge was carved by trenchal glacial meltwater as the ice sheets about two and a half million years ago. The crags consist of lower magnesium limestone, thick hard granular layers, valuable building material, um, stone from the thicker beds. Some of the stone, the stone could control Roshan Abbey, was cut from the rock faces seen in the gorge today. So there we go, so this is it, look. <coughs> Better living conditions in monasteries than they did anywhere else because they yeah. had lots of good food and all the peasant people went there when they were sick and because they, they were like, oh my gosh. So there's the limestone they clips, look. I know that germs might have like yeah. got the cores of disease until that pasta guy. Pasta, Louis Pasta. Yeah, for yeah. humans. It's nice, isn't it? Not, not it's my so I'm not sure which part Capability Brown uh, landscaped out because I can't I can't see that from here. But uh, maybe that's further on. I don't know. I can't quite establish that. So these are the cliffs. Look, and then I'll be so. Yeah. <laughs> Around here. So there's the more of the limestone there, look, the cliffs. The paths go in different directions here. We'll maybe just walk down this way and see where this leads us. They look like they might be on a guided tour there. I said there was guided tours on a Saturday. So she's probably explaining about the latrines which were over the river, I imagine. You can hear a generator, that big thing there. I don't know what that's doing. You can hear it, it's really noisy. I wonder what that's doing there. It's a bit strange, isn't it? Oh. When have you got the biology exam? The 20th of June, period two. Mm -hmm. And then our last one is physics, like period five on the Friday. Oh, okay. So that's going to be easy. These are your worse. mock GCSEs? Yeah. Oh. But we don't have to learn all the content, roughly. Like for history, we're only doing one paper on two topics all day. Yeah. So look, this is where they channeled the water under the monastery. See that? They made it quite fast flowing. What do you think of that, eh? Yeah. Well, we'll have this, we just stand on here. Oh, look, it goes to two channels. Watch me, don't tip over that. All right. There's all this wild garlic. Boardwalk here, you can hear water coming down. We'll go and have a look at this. So, we're just in this little quite a wet area on boardwalk here, and there's a little waterfall. Have a look at the waterfall, huh? Maybe this is bits that Capability Brown did. I can't, I need to understand that a bit better. Like what Capability Brown did compared to what the Cistercians did. The Abbey was a Cistercian Abbey. Look 
looks good, isn't it, that? Right. Right, Stephanie, what do you think of the waterfall? Ooh. This. So who wants to try and cross the stepping stones? They're quite wide mine, so be careful. You might be slipping. Shall we have a look, see what... All right. Just be careful, don't... Yeah. Go on, just take your time. Go down to that one, that's it. Take your time. All right, all right, not unnecessarily doing it. What are you doing? I thought we were going that way. We're going to have a little look up here, see what's up here. Can we get a passport and go to France? Well, let's have a look. Ooh, look at this massive lake here. Ducks yeah. and everything. Look at the massive lake. I don't want to go. Massive lake. Yeah, it's on the tree. No, no. Look at that, look. Look at all the ducks and the reed beds and things in there. Maybe this is what, this is, these are the features that kick Billy Brown. I don't know. Have to have a look. This is called uh, Lawton Pond and uh, Hooton Dyke flows into Lawton Pond. So, and then that goes down to where the Abbey is. So there must have been two water sources. You had the, the Hooton Dyke and the Maltby Dyke going down to that valley bottom where the Abbey is. So they knew they had a good source of fresh water and things there. So it's a, it's a site of special scientific interest with the uh, limestone, the plants that grow on the limestone cliffs and things like that. Wild garlic is still in flower here. Cow slips, what have you? Cow parsley, that's cow parsley. Oh, so we get a different view of the the abbey from here. Yeah, that's quite good, isn't it? There you go, and they're still on the little tour there. Tremendous growth on these, considering it's uh, May. If you look at the height of everybody compared to the plants, the vegetation's going right up. This is why you don't take your food. Well, keep walking, keep walking. Yeah. It's uh, Saturday, and it's probably about one o'clock now, I think. So hopefully we can get across the river here. Yeah. 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 Y